Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. It's me again, Angelita. Okay, for today's video, gagawa na naman tayo ng panibagong tutorial kung papaano mahanap or malocate ang inyong missing or worst lost or stolen phone. So, gagamit po tayo ng um, pwedeng computer browser or you can use uh, a downloaded app galing sa Play Store. Yung name ng application na gagamitan natin is Find My Device. So far, this is the best tracking device na alam kong legit, proven and tested. Okay, so without further ado, let's now start this tutorial. Okay, first let us uh, go to your browser, google.com, and then type find Okay, find my device. Enter. Okay, so this one. Find my device, Google. Okay. So, ayan. Ang in my case, nakalagin na kasi yung Google account na ginagamit ko sa phone ko. So, kailangan may nakalink na Google account doon sa phone nyo and doon sa laptop nyo or sa computer ninyo or sa bagong phone na gagamitin ninyo na pang track. So, kailangan nyo ilag in doon yung Gmail account na connected doon sa missing, lost, or stolen phone ninyo. Okay? So, ang gagawin niya ng find my device is isi-search niya po yung phone and then, let's try it again. Search. And then, mga ilang seconds lang yun. Ipapakita niya na yung location. So, in my case, nandito na pala yung location niya. So, yung pwede ninyong magawa dito sa Google Find My Device is um, kapag or halimbawa na, na misplaced nyo lang yung phone ninyo, pwede nyo siyang um, maparing. Kahit na po naka-silent mode yung phone ninyo, magre-ring siya. Okay? I like this one. Play sound. Nagre-ring po yung phone na sinit na tinrack ko. So, ayan, madali rin yung mahanap dahil kahit nakasilent siya, magre-ring siya. Okay. If ever naman hindi ninyo makuha, you can secure your device. And then, maglalagay kayo ng recovery message na papasok doon sa device na hinahanap ninyo. And then, phone number, you can add it para if ever maka makita nung nakakuha ng phone ninyo, yung message, maibalik po niya. Maibalik po niya. Uh, ma-text or ma-contact ka po niya gamit yung phone number na pin-revide mo. Okay? And then, another one is erase device. This one will delete all content from your device. And once your device has been erased, you cannot locate it anymore. So, kung may pag-asa pa kayo sa tingin niyo, may pag-asa pa kayo, don't do this first. Okay? Ito muna yung gawin ninyong dalawa. Pero kung wala na talaga, erase device nyo na. Kagaya sa case ko, in-erase device ko na siya. Pero, hindi siya may erase device unless naka-turn on yung phone. Pero, once na ginawa nyo yung erase device at tinurn on ng kung sino man yung phone ninyo, it will automatically delete all the content on your mobile phone. So, ayan. Let's see yung location ng phone ko. So, nandito accurate na accurate po yung ibibigay na location sa inyo ni Google Find My Device. So, this is how easy to locate or track your missing, stolen, or lost phone. Okay? So, eh, depende na lang sa tao kung nakakuha ay ibabalik yung cellphone niyo. Pero, um, you still have the pag-asa dahil nakikita ninyo sa Find My Device yung phone. Okay, so these uh, three phones are actually uh, connected doon sa Gmail account ko. But itong isang phone na ito, Poco X3 NFC, ito po yung nawawala akong phone wherein I cannot 
locate this phone anymore. Nung pagkawala lang po niya, hindi ko na po siya na-locate. Kasi naka-turn off yung mobile data, naka-turn off yung wifi, naka-turn off yung location. So, make sure kung daladala nyo palagi yung phone nyo sa laba, labas, make sure naka-turn on ang data, wifi, or your location para mas madaling ma-detect kung nasaan yung device ninyo. You see, cannot be rich na. Simula nung pagkawala nito, hindi na talaga siya ma-reach. So, kaya ganyan, wala na akong pag-asa. in erase device ko na yun. So, ganyan lang po kadali kung pa paano i-locate yung device niyo. I hope this video helps you. So, see you on my next tutorial. Thanks for listening. Bye!